hey guys welcome back to my channel so today we're gonna be creating a bot with a multi-choice option okay so we're on bot composer now I'm going to change this message so welcome to the college bot so this is going to be a bot that it'll ask me which college do I want to enroll in so this is just a message that's going to appear at the beginning so now I'm going to add the multi-choice option so I'm going to come here to the plus sign I'm going to go to ask a question because I'm actually asking something to the bot right so I'm going to ask a multi-choice option here in the first uh, in the first prompt we're going to ask the user the option so what university do you prefer so this is the question and here I'm gonna have the options so I'm going to come here to the user input choice option I'm going to store whatever option is clicked on a variable so I'm going to use user dot college so I'm going to have this as my property that's going to store the whatever the user clicked on and then I'm going to scroll down I'm going to have the options here so in the array of choices you're going to add the options my first option is going to be for example KSU University second option CUW University third option is going to be I don't know NY, NYU University so I'm going to have these three options whenever I type a new option I'm gonna have it here so it's going to basically it's gonna pop it up in this bot uh, menu here okay I have my three options now let's just scroll down and for now I'm gonna run the bot just to see the options if they're working or not so if I start the bot and I click on the web chat option open web chat and then I restart the conversation I'm gonna have my uh, welcome to the college bot response and then the flow is gonna move down and it's going to ask me what university do you prefer so I have the three options here of course nothing's gonna happen if I click on one of those because I haven't done anything else okay let's just close this uh, bot for now and I'm gonna do something else so I'm going to actually click on this add I'm going to go to create a condition and I'm going to go to uh, branch switch multiple options here I'm going to pass my property which is user.college user user.college so I'm actually passing this option so whatever the user clicked here it's being stored on user.college variable and I'm gonna pass this here okay so perfect so here is where I provide the options of actually what to do if the user clicks on KSU CUAW or NYU so I'm going to provide options for that I'm going to come over here click on this scroll down and there's this cases option so I'm going to add a new option and the first option is going to be KSU the second option is going to be CUW and the third option is going to be NYU so I have these three cases notice that you have three options here and notice that whenever you create a new case the options get created on the bot okay so now we want to do something if the user clicks on KSU so I'm going to come here to KSU 
and I'm going to send a response. I'm going to say welcome to KSU. That's going to be the message. And I'm going to do the same with CUW. I'm going to send a response, but this time it's going to be CUW. And the third option is going to be NYU. I'm going to send a response as well, but this time it's going to be NYU. Okay, that's basically it. Let's just run the bot so we can test it out. Okay, it's just going to take a few seconds. It's supposed to provide me with these three options. And if I click on KSU, I'm going to have Welcome to KSU. If I click on CUW, Welcome to CUW. And the same with NYU. Okay, let me just run it again because I clicked somewhere else and it's, uh, it stopped. So I'm going to hit on uh, open web chat. I'm going to restart a conversation and I'm going to have my three options here. So if I click on KSU, I'm going to have welcome to KSU. Let's restart the bot. CUW, welcome to CUW. And for NYU, welcome to NYU. All right, perfect. So. I'm going to show you how to change this option so the menu is displayed in a different way. So let's just go over here to the multi uh, prompt option and you guys have to scroll down, go to lifestyle, sorry, list style, and then you gotta you gotta hit on this hero car option. And if you run the bot again you're going to have a different style. Let's just give it a couple of seconds. Let's try to open this on web chat again. Now you have a different layout. So you have the three options, but it's displaying in a better way. So if you have like I don't know, seven or eight options here in this menu may be a better way to display the other way. But since I'm uh, having just three options here, I feel like this is a better way to show it. All right, that's pretty much it. So let's just click on uh, CUW. I'm going to have the message for CUW. All right. So that's pretty much it. So that's how you guys can work with multiple options in Buck Composer. So I hope you guys like the video and I'll see you in the next video.